Hi guys, a few weeks ago I published a video on how a MAC diet plan works. Today I'm showing a sample of MAC diet plan to give an idea how you should plan your meal for the day. If you still haven't seen my video on AMAD or want to know what a MAC diet plan is, then I recommend watching that video. Its link is in the description box and in the end of this video. Also, please check for the replacements as per your health conditions in my OMAD diet video. So let's get started. Start your meal or break your fast with energy balls and a cup of green coffee or green tea. There are three recipes in my channel in a single video, which you can follow. I think having two energy balls is a good way to break your fast after almost 23 hours of fasting, as these are guilt-free snacks, rich in proteins, healthy fats, fiber and natural sugars. They will provide you with instant energy which is much needed after this long fast and stabilize the blood sugar levels. They are also filling, will help in weight loss, plus they are healthy and will provide you with essential vitamins in a day. Both green tea and green coffee have exceptional health and weight loss benefits. But green coffee is decaffeinated and more effective in weight loss as it contains chlorogenic acid which boosts your metabolism and burns fat. After 20 minutes, have your main course and for this, I am showing two options, one for the vegetarians and second for the non-vegetarians. The first recipe is chickpea with cottage cheese or paneer. As most of us know how to make chickpeas or chole at home, I am not showing a very detailed recipe. I am using 250 grams of boiled chickpeas and a cup of fresh paneer or cottage cheese and this will get you two portions. If you wish to know how to make weight loss paneer at home, I have a video on the same and its link is in the description box. To make chickpea recipe, I have taken a pan and added some olive oil. Once it's hot, add few cumin seeds and black peppercorns. When cumin seeds start turning brown, add one finely chopped onion. Wait till it turns brown and then add half a cup of tomato puree. Stir well and add one tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. Once they are fried properly, add the boiled chickpeas. Mix well, add some water and salt as per taste. You can also add some dry spices as you like. Then cover it with a lid and let it come to a boil. After few minutes, add the paneer cubes and put the lid back for 2-3 to three minutes. And our chickpea paneer recipe is done. Chickpea and paneer together make a good combination and are filling. They are also an excellent source of protein and fiber which are a must while following OMAD. For the non-vegetarians, I am showing a chicken recipe using one breast piece. I have taken cubes of one chicken breast, some French or green beans and half a cup of coconut milk. Add some oil to the pan and then throw in few ginger juliennes. Next add some finely chopped garlic and let them turn light brown. Next add the cubes of chicken breast and mix well. Add 1 fourth teaspoon each of turmeric powder, cumin powder and curry powder and salt as per taste. Mix well and when the chicken is almost cooked, add half a cup of tomato puree. Stir fry for 2 minutes and add half a cup of coconut milk. Coconut milk reduces your appetite, increases metabolism and helps in losing belly fat. Next add green beans and let it come to a boil. You can also add some water if you wish to have some more gravy. And our chicken and coconut milk is ready. This recipe is rich in proteins, fiber and healthy fats. Chicken has a good amount of protein, plus I've also incorporated a green vegetable in a non-vegetarian recipe, which is a good idea. So even you can keep this in mind when you plan your meals. And coconut milk has healthy fats which will keep you going through the day. Include a plate of salads in your meals. It will keep you hydrated and provide you with an extra dose of fiber and freshness. You can have plain roti or Indian bread, weight loss rotis or brown rice. Feel free to use some clarified butter or ghee or olive oil as it has healthy fats. Rice eaters may opt for brown rice instead of white rice as white rice has empty carbs. The playlist of weight loss rotis is in the description box. This is how a vegetarian or mat plate should look like. A portion of salad, grains in form of roti or rice and proteins in form of chickpeas and paneer. In case of non-vegetarians, you have chicken with green beans. Portion size is not a constraint on a mat, so eat till you're full. Do not count calories. You can also replace chickpea paneer with spinach paneer recipe or replace chicken with boiled eggs as it also tastes great. 
by the end of one hour eating window, have a glass of buttermilk. I'll leave its recipe link below in the description box. It cools down your body and keeps you full and hydrated for a long time. It will also provide you with calcium and healthy bacteria for proper digestion. Try to eat something new and healthy every day as your body gets everything it needs plus you will not get bored and thus be able to continue with the diet plan. Do ensure to include greens, veggies, lentils, proteins, carbs, healthy fats in your diet. Have a multivitamin tablet along with the meal so that it takes care of any nutritional deficiencies. As mentioned before, for food replacements or for any questions or clarifications, please go through my previous video on a mat. Hope this simple diet plan helps you start with your mat diet. You'll be able to lose stubborn fat, lower cholesterol, clear brain fog and lose weight fast with a mat. I will see you soon with a new video. Till then, eat right and stay bright. Bye-bye.